Hello, how are you my good people? I really have missed you. I know it's been more than a month since I was here. When I say I miss you, I miss the comments that you write me. Some good, some criticized, some hating, but it's all beautiful. It's all an amazing ensemble. Now, um, today I want to give tribute to the late Buster Godfrey Migwe. Apparently, I just learned of him a few days ago, actually this Sunday, when I saw a clip that he had posted about me and he was looking for me and he had quite a lot to say about me. Sababu ya kuja hapa live ni kwa sababu ya Miss Morgan yuri ya likuwa na anaact na saitu na poongea Miss Morgan maisha yake ya meharibika na hana mtu wa kumulilia marafiki wake watu wa walimuacha It's unfortunate that he's gone and God honestly rest his soul in peace and I actually feel so touched that a man of God thought about me in that way but I don't know where he misconstrued his thoughts. I don't know, whether, was it a vision or where was he getting it from? He spoke about me being under the water or in a messed up situation. She said that I was in Missouri, but sometimes there was a place where I was in Missouri. I was in Missouri. Si pazuri. Kwa hivyo wanataka yule anaweza ni connect na Miss Morgan ama aletwe kwa ofisi yangu. Ninawahakishia atafunguliwa na hiyo kifungo ya pombe because of depression itaondoka. I wish she was here for me to let him know that I'm okay. I'm the one who came out and said if you all remember and if you've been following this channel, I first came out in Kamunja's show and said I had a problem with alcoholism and I went through depression. But how he put it was like, I'm under the trench, which is not the truth. Alcoholism is real. I've undergone it. And like I said, I'm a work in progress. Depression is real. I have gone through it. I'm still work in progress. Unfortunately, I'm in an industry where I'm easy targeted. But I need it to stop. I just need it. I just need people. If you really want to know the story, use the right channel. Don't use hearsay. Don't use hearsay. Don't listen to people who think they know more than I do. We Miss Morgan, wale wanao mjua, wamulete, tuanze kumbadilisha. Kama Gideliman alimebadilika na amekuja hapa, hata huyo Miss Morgan atabadilika. I am okay. And I will repeat it. I've gone through alcoholism. I've gone through depression. And I am work in progress. Fortunately, I learned about this. Unfortunately, I learned about Pastor Migwe after he had passed on. And I keep saying, rest him in peace. But I, I found it through my mom. And the reason I say it's good I found it through my mom is because she knows me. She knows what he was saying was misconstrued. It's ludicrous. I'm not really trying to redeem myself here. I'm just saying, let's use the right channel. I have a YouTube channel. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Instagram. I give my business number right here. <laughs> Please stop tarnishing people in the fame people in the industry just because you know us how to. 
it doesn't feel so good. Because people who care about me watch this. And then I get calls like, are you okay? Are you doing okay? I am okay. But the more you keep asking me, are you okay? Are you okay? Because someone said this. Let's stop that. Let's just stop that. It doesn't feel right. And it affects a big circle. Okay. Rest in peace, Pastor Megwe. Rest in peace. And I'm okay. Thank you. God bless you.